Now it's my pleasure to uh, introduce Rosa Rosales, President, League of the United Latin American Citizens. Thank you. Good morning, how's everybody? Good you know, this is uh, such a great event that I'm kind of speechless, you might say. Uh, I, I am so honored to be among all of you all here, all these national organizations, all these great leaders, you know, and it takes the whole community working together to make a difference. As I became the national president, one of the things that rang in my mind is the high school dropout. And for years and years and years, I've been saying, we're in a state of alarm in the education of our children, you know, but then it gets tired of just saying we're in a state of alarm. What are we doing about it? And this is a plan of action. So I'm very delighted that LULAC, the oldest and the largest Latino organization in the nation, is being part of this. It is a great honor to be here, and it is very, uh, to me, emotional, you know, you might say, uh, to be here in, in such a great day because we are taking a plan of action. LULAC is very pleased uh, to join the Campaign for High School Equity. We know for many, many years it hasn't been there. It is not that our students do not achieve, it's that we don't have the right materials, the right atmosphere, environment, to create this uh, uh, wanting to be successful. And so uh, it is very important that the action is occurring, but that the federal level needs to come up to par. We need those monies, we need those programs to ensure a quality education for all our students. You know, the, the high school dropout crisis is just so tremendous that we know as we uh, uh, become uh, all minorities in the nation and, and Latinos come becoming one of the largest uh, populations in the nation, that we have to be prepared. And what is more important than a good quality education? You know, when we say uh, 7,000 7, students drop out on a daily basis, that's just not acceptable. That is just not acceptable. And all of us should be in anger that this is happening, that our students are not getting the education. One student drop out is too many. So LULAC is very great uh, to be here because the crisis the Latinos uh, that we do need 53% dropping out. And, and minorities, you know, our percentages are just not acceptable in dropping out in high school. We know that uh, there are solutions to this crisis. And we must, we must have, have strong, strong policy, policy leader, leaders uh, to, uh, to understand what, and what is hap happening. And urgently uh, uh, urge our, our representatives and, and, and the federal government to bring the solutions to high schools to comprehensive reform. It is for this reason that LULAC National Office, with all its chapters, you know, that we reach out. And one of the things that's very important is to get the community involved. You know, parents need to get involved. Communities need involved. And LULAC has a beautiful network of councils all over the nation to include Puerto Rico. And this is how we, we must reach out. Reach out and bring, this is a community issue. Uh, this is a human rights issue. This is a civil rights issue. Education is a must, not a privilege. Everyone is entitled in this country to get a good quality education. And that's why this type of action uh, for high school equity is so important. You know, uh, families and communities play key roles, you know, uh, in shaping the educational environment uh, for students. Too often students uh, do not have that access to this quality education. And community support has to be there. You know, uh, this campaign also highlights uh, the need to provide more support for community-based organizations, you know, that too many times, you know, uh, they run school uh, after school. <laughs> I'm running out of time here, uh, but finally let me just recognize the vital importance of creating business and community partnerships that support students' enrichment opportunities, internships, and other ones. And let me just say uh, thanks to everyone. Now let us move forward. Education, like uh, I think uh, Trevino said, is the liberating force that no one can take away. Thank you so much.